completed our third video about compounded interest. First video, we applied two ways by Excel and by TR8384 to solve the compounded interest problems. In the second one, we have more examples. Now in this video, we are going to solve some problems for the loans and amortization. Okay, this is our first problem. Keywords compounded and monthly behind the compounded. So five years, five times 12. Interest rate per year is three, so three divided by 12. And the payment is negative 600. Present value, so cover the zero, alpha, enter. Then we get this answer. You could use the Excel, so we want to get a present value. PV. So rate here, be careful because a calculator, you have the percent. But the Excel, you need to type 0 0.03 and divide by 12 because the keyword behind it compounded is monthly. And NPR is 5 times 12. And the PMT is negative 600. Enter. And the second question. You need to build the table. So unpaid balance start from 50,000 compounded annually. Now go to three years, so three percent is six. And the present value is five, then four zeros. Then ask you the payment. Reset zero, then cover the zero, enter. It doesn't say you pay in the beginning of year or end of year. So default, we just choose end. So payment is every year you need to pay this $18,705.49. Also, you can just use Excel, so payment. And the rate is 0 0.06. And for three years, present value five, four zeros, then enter. Red color, that means you need to pay. It's a negative, so you need to pay. Okay, so now we could just go down. So every year you pay that much money. Now you, right now you have the present value. So 50,000, you already have it. But every year you pay back. After three years, your balance should be zero. Okay, now let's fill in the table. First year, the interest, because your unpaid balance is 50,000 times 0 0.06. In order to simplify this calculation load, I just change it to if I negative. So I just change the number become positive. So then easy to calculate. So that's the interest. So every year you you pay this much money, but then inside this payment, 3,000 is interest. So your balance reduction should be this money minus the interest and you pay this go to the principal so your unpaid balance it should be this number minus this and in the second year you pay the same amount what's the interest interest is the unpaid balance times 0 0.06 not 50,000 because you only unpaid balance here so you pay the interest that much then what's the balance reduction? How much go to the principal? So is this minus the interest. Then this you go to the principal. So the unpaid balance should be this number minus reduction this. And the third year in this payment, what's the interest? The interest is unpaid balance times 0 0.06. And the balance reduction is this payment minus the interest. Then the left is go to the balance, the principal. So now you see this number and this number, they are same. Then your balance is zero. Okay, now let's go to number three. So purchase $18,000 and the 3000 is down pay. So he only earned 15000 right and uh, this payment is Samuel annually in over next three years so three years should time two and the interest is eight divided by two because Samuel annually and the uh,
present value, he got fifteen thousand because eighteen minus three thousand. That's down pay. And what's the payment? So reset zero, cover the zero, alpha enter. And so payment PMT. So the interest rate is zero point zero eight. Don't forget to divide by two because Samuel annually and three years three times two. Fifteen thousand. You see the red color as means uh, you need to pay. Okay, so now the total amount to pay over the life of the loan. Every half year you pay that much money, you need a times six because three years, so six half year. Then what's the answer? Here is this number times six. Don't forget you have down pay. So then you need to add 3,000. So this answer, you need to add 3,000. And the third one, the total interest paid over the, so every half year you pay that much money times six. Total you paid minus you only under 15,000, right? So this answer should be this time six minus 15,000. Okay, so those three is your answer. Let's do the last question. 12% then because monthly. And the end is 48 months. And the payment is negative 800 every month. What's the present value? Cover the zero, alpha, enter. We get this much money. Non pay is 36,000 minus this number. All we could do, this is the present value. So 0 0.12. One two divided by twelve and the end is forty eight months. Payment is negative eight hundred. The down pay should be thirty six thousand minus this. Okay, so that's the answer.